Top story this half hour, new warning from the FDA this morning added to the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. This is all about a rare autoimmune disorder that's been reported in a number of people that have received the shot. This latest warning, though, has not changed the overall messaging from health officials. 12 News reporter Erica Ritchie joining us live in studio this morning with what they're saying about this right now. Well, guys, they're saying that the benefits of the Johnson & Johnson shot outweigh the risks of contracting COVID. That's been their mantra since the vaccines emerged, and they're sticking to it despite this latest warning tacked on to the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. Now, the warning of Guillain-Barre syndrome being a side effect of the J&J &J vaccine was added to the fact sheet late last week. It is a rare neurological disorder in which the immune system attacks the nerves, causing muscle weakness. The FDA issued the warning following 100 reported cases of the disease in which 95 were serious and required hospitalization. Now that's against the backdrop of 12.8 million doses being administered in the U.S. and in the face of the Delta variant on the move here in our country, something one physician believes is a bigger threat than developing a serious side effect from the vaccine. If the Delta variant is allowed to accelerate, sure, I think we could see additional variants so Johnson & Johnson released its own statement yesterday acknowledging the potential for the Guillain-Barre side effect and updated its fact sheet to reflect that as well. They say the safety and well-being of the people who use their products is their number one priority. Live in studio this morning, I'm Erica Ritchie, 12 News.